I'm Jen, your local New York City guide, and today I'm sharing some amazing fast food from the Philippines, Jollibee. Now here in Times Square. Let's go. You're probably wondering why is there a line behind me and a cult following for this Filipino fast food chain? What you should order, how does it compare to other Jollibees, and what do I, an Italian-American pasta lover, think of this unique pasta with sweet hot dog sauce? Stay tuned for all of this and more, and please click the subscribe and bell button so you don't miss a future video. I do a ton of videos on New York City, travel, and food. Jolly Beauty Times Square location opened on October 27th, 2018 at 609 8th Avenue between West 39th and 40th Streets. When it first opened, the first 40 customers received free Chicken Joy for a year. Okay, let's start with a little history. It all started in 1975 in Cubao as a Magnolia ice cream parlor. The first Jollibee store in the USA was opened in 1998 in Daly City, California to serve Filipino and Filipino-American families in the area. It is well-loved and has a cult following because for many it embodies a familiar feeling of home. There are now 34 locations in the USA, mostly in California. The first Jollibee on the East Coast was open in Woodside, Queens. This Times Square opening is the first in Manhattan. So you're probably wondering, what should you order? Jolly Bee is well known for its chicken joy and gravy, which is fried chicken that's crispy on the outside and juicy on the inside. You can order a chicken joy drumstick with the Jolly Spaghetti, soft pasta with uniquely sweet Filipino style tomato sauce and cut up red hot dogs topped with cheddar cheese. One of their most popular sweet drinks, which is like a Filipino milkshake, not yet available in the limited menu at the Times Square location is the Hollow Hollow. I'm Jen, thank you for taking this tour of Jollibee with me, trying some amazing new things, including spaghetti, which is a bit sweeter with hot dogs, which I actually liked. I know it sounds surprising for an Italian to say that, but it was actually really good. And it's a little sweeter, it's, you know, it's something that you have it's a very good fast food. It's not the best thing I've ever tasted, but it's not as bad as I thought it was. <laughs> so come here, try that, try their fried chicken. It's really good, really crunchy. And of course their peach dessert, peach mango pie. It is so amazing. You have to come and try it for yourself. Don't forget to click the subscribe and bell button so you don't miss a future video. As always, say yes to new adventures and I'll see you next time. Bye.